Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel! It's been a while na hindi ako nakapag-vlog kasi I have been very busy with different stuffs lately. And in today's vlog po, isashare ko sa inyo kung paano namin sinelebrate yung first birthday ng baby ko. Ano yung total expenses na nagamit namin in making my baby's first birthday memorable and successful which happened during MECQ kasi my baby's birthday was last June and then nung May biglang nag-surge yung COVID cases sa place namin <gasps> kaya we were placed under MECQ so ang nangyari po uh, mga 2 months pa lang before June naghanap na ako ng exclusive venue and then kumuha na din ako ng um, organizing team para mag-organize sana sa first birthday ng baby ko. But hindi yun natuloy. Kasi nga biglang nag-MECQ kaya bawal na yung mga gatherings and then um, nag-close din yung resort na nag-book ko ahead. So I canceled them and decided na sa bahay na lang i-celebrate yung first birthday ng baby ko kasi it's better safe than sorry. You know how much my baby loves Coco Melon so much kaya um yun yung napili naming theme for our pre-birthday shoot at saka during her first birthday kasi um my baby really loves Coco Melon so much. So, yung mga mummies na may mga babies din na mahilig sa Coco Melon, um, I hope I get to share um, some ideas with you. Mga mummies, on the next slides po, share ko sa inyo yung actual event na nangyari, yung uh, decorations and foods at kung um, magkano yung na-spend namin in total. So, um, if you're interested po, continue watching. Nag-schedule ako ng pre-birthday shoot para naman magkaroon kami ng visible remembrance for my baby's first birthday. And also, um, during the day, kasi nga limited yung time ko at saka um, wala din ako masyadong talent sa mga DIY decorations. Kaya kumuha na lang ko ng mag-decorate at saka nag-order na lang din ako ng mga food trays kasi wala na akong time magluto. And also, hindi na kami nag-invite ng other people outside our house, even our closest family and friends kasi nga, we were on MECQ. Kaya, kami lang na nasa bahay yung nag-celebrate. And it was fun. We, we all had fun during that day. And also, we really took time to go to the church to thank God for my baby's life and for all the blessings He is giving us every day despite the pandemic. And for me, sobrang memorable and successful naman yung first birthday ng baby ko. Kahit hindi nangyari yung original plan ko na typical birthday party talaga where we get to invite many kids para naman masiyahan yung baby ko. Kasi nga, inisip ko, what's most important is that we are all safe and healthy. Yun lang naman po. So, to all mummies, um, masasabi ko lang po is that we do not have to spend too much to make the best birthday for our baby, especially yung first birthday. Um, kung ano lang yung makakaya natin, that's good enough. They will definitely appreciate kung ano yung ginagawa natin best effort for them. Kasi mafe-feel nila yun, I'm sure. So, huwag lang natin kalimutang mag-pray at magpasalamat kay God 
for the life of our babies, for our family, for our safety, and for our good health every day. Yun na naman yung pinaka-importante on top of those material things na meron tayo. So having a chance to celebrate our baby's first birthday is more than enough po. So yun na po guys, and um, I hope I was able to inspire you and give you some ideas. And thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.